Hello YouTube again. Now I'm going to do a case review on the DLO jam jacket. Now I got this for Christmas also. Now this is for the first generation. My mom bought it and I was going to try it out but I couldn't find a way to get it open. So I just kind of, because there's like little tabs right here. They're really hard to see but there's a tab right here that sticks out. Of, right here. There's like a tab that sticks out through the cardboard. So I had to go like this and open it. But yeah, you already can see that package. It's, it's not the greatest idea, like design, but I like the package because it's very, um, like vibrant with colors and stuff. I guess you could say. But okay, we don't need that. Now here's here is the actual jam jacket. Now I think you just yeah, you just open it up like this. And pop the other part. Oh, it comes like this. Okay. Now this part comes over the case. So we can just throw that aside. You, there comes with a screen protector, which I already used mine, but and it didn't really go too well. But it was a nice protector, and it and they are reusable. But here it is. It comes with this now this shows you nothing in here but it shows you how to um wrap your headphones in the back which we will get to so here's the case guys um it's a lint magnet i had have to say so i don't i don't use this too much because i have the best skins ever on mine but it's uh it's pretty uh flimsy a little bit like in this part like but it does not really stretch that much and these top corners right here are very very durable rubber but this part goes like this whenever it's on there so I'm just gonna stick this on my iPod really quick just go from bottom to top and there it's on there see that what I mean about that but it fits on the second gen pretty nicely I have to say it's pretty solid I'm not afraid to drop it or anything that's pretty loud but the reason why this really doesn't work the best I mean it works nice but one thing is you can see the home button it's not all the way in there because they moved it it's auto brightness used to, used to be right there I mean it yeah, on the 1G now, it's like over here more. And the volume rockers, I mean, you can still access them. I'm pushing them. But I don't think that's a relevant issue, but like this part. But yeah, it protects very nicely. And I feel that um, with this on my iPod, it's, it's protected very nicely. And if I dropped it from like 100 feet, it'd still be fine. Cause this and this rubber on the sides, it's got grips here also. Um, and yeah, they they give add grip. I guess what's called the jam jacket. Yeah. But um, yeah, I really do like these parts on the side. I like every case, silicone case should have like extra rubber on the sides like that. And the home button is real nice on there very nice on there now let's get to this part so what you do you can have your headphones now this is the main attraction of the case here you can get, grab your headphones and then what you do you're supposed to I guess stick it through this hole right here but I don't know how you're gonna get this part through that hole I don't know but you just stick it in right here my timer is about to go off pretty soon. And you just wrap it around. So I'll do that. I'll get it wrapped around. So now you never have to wrap your cables around your iPod, which this used to be an issue without the speaker, I guess. But now it's not really because you don't need to carry headphones with you all the time now. Now I just go like this and run this like this. And usually that reaches, but. Yeah, so. Oops. 
There goes my timer. I'm just, I've never really used it before. So yeah, that's how that works. I guess you can use these little tabs on the side here to hold it in too. Like there's little slits. But the bottom part also, where the, this is cut out nice, um, you can access your um, your pin adapter. I don't know what that is. And your earphone jack, the charging cable port. I don't know whatever you want to call that. So yeah, I give this case for the 2G about a probably like a three and a half to four range. I'm guessing. So this is like the only case I've had, and I think it protects great, and it works wonderful.